Breaking news, we have a trade in the NFL. Former Jets starting quarterback and number two overall pick, Zach Wilson, is now being traded to the Denver Broncos, hoping for a fresh start. The deal includes a late-round pick swap, six for seventh, and New York Jets will pay some of Wilson's roughly $5.5 million salary. Fresh start for a good boy. Yeah, he's a good, he's boy. A good boy. Great good boy. boy. Sweet boy. He's a good boy. He's, he's from that area of the country. You know, Utah's over there. That is much well closer. Said. You uh -huh. know, I think the city would be great for him. <laughs> Sean yeah. Payton, obviously, a mastermind on the offense. We all know that. We've seen the success that he had uh, at the Saints. Are hoping for the same thing there. I think Zach Wilson was looking for a fresh start. The Jets were looking for a fresh start. And the Broncos certainly looking for a fresh start as well. Good for Zach. Good for the Broncos. Good for the Jets. It's oh, a win-win-win, yeah. AJ. Win-win-win. Yeah, it is. He gets to play with Sean Payton. Also, like, Zach, at least they traded for him. Like, a team wants you. A team came and and gave up stuff to come get you, so they're not like they're going to give you a shot to, to try to develop you and see what, what you can do. And he can spin it. He can. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He can spin well, it. I mean, on, yeah. You know, I don't know. You, you never know. You never know what a change of scenery can do, especially for a quarterback. Well, especially. I mean, we talked to Zach a little bit. He's a good boy. He's yeah. a sweet boy. Good dude. Yeah. He said he, he watched us. He's heard us, and obviously. Uh, he knows of all the chitter chatter about him, I think. He has experience in the New York media and the failure and a couple of different coaches. And uh, I'm seeing ghosts. I mean, there was, was that him? That was that Darnold. Was Darnold. Oh, but he's other so blonde. Yeah, yeah too. same difference. They both sucked in New York. Yeah. Whoa. But Sam Darnold now with the Vikings has exactly. a shot. Has exactly. a shot with Kevin O'Connell. But nonetheless, everything that happened was, oh, the mom. And the, yeah, there you yeah. go. Whole, yep. Yep, There's there. a lot. There's a lot. He now gets to kind of cleanse himself, mm -hmm. go to the Rockies yeah. with a team that is looking for a new person. And now the Broncos have a little security going into the draft that we have a guy that can spin it on our roster. Yeah, I also get heavy uh, Drew Locke vibes from Zach Wilson. And basically Drew Locke's now in New York with the Giants and Zach Wilson's going to Denver where Drew Locke was. It's just one big happy family. Is, is, is Zach Wilson called that bitch my bodyguard? Yeah, that's my bodyguard. No, like Drew, Drew Locke. Yeah, that, no, Zach Wilson's like kind of vibe. Uh, Listen to like Mumford and Sons when they were at the draft and everyone side, was standing next to me. They know they go hard. I know, but Mumford and Sons goes real hard. <laughs> I agree. I, I really love talking about a blonde Sons. that could spin it. I mean, Zach Wilson, if he gets out in that mountain air again, oh, let's not do this. Like he's back in. You're yeah, right. Yeah, I think not, you're right. Let's like not do. This. Better pay him. Better open up your checkbook. You gotta pay that no. dude. Well, the Jets, Jets are actually paying. Yeah, yeah. Swapping a six and a seven, and we'll pay for it, please. Yeah. Please! That's what they said. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine him just cross body in front of that orange crush. Yep. His in those new uniforms. Mile high, too, thinner air. Oh. Oh, my God. That's, that's a missile. You think Team 3 is Team three still in Denver? Can he pick up a few of them? It's Team 2 now. Oh. That's right. What if he did just acquire Team 3, turn them into Team 2? No, no. Team 3 is at home. Okay. Where's that? That's right in Pittsburgh. I saw him wear a glove for the opening pitch. Wore a glove. Yep. He wore full BP, four BP. Yeah, I mean, he was doing it. I he think was he, hitting dongs. Yeah, 17 home runs in 20 pitches. He Pretty burned good. that Whoa. fucking sucker down the middle, he did too. too. Whoa. I appreciate that he... Yeah. He's not fucking around. Playing catch with Kutch. Just yeah, spinning, spinning it. it. Yeah. Well, Kutch, I mean, he put, he's playing catch with Kutch because he's not sure how long Kutch is going to be in Pittsburgh. Mm, nice pitch. It's a great pitch. And he has a glove on. I mean, you know, ceremonial pitch, normally you don't get to wear the glove, but... He was taking a little BP and some infield practice earlier, so he kept his glove. Yeah. And he's not even on the mound. Well, he's he's Wait, he didn't go all the way up to the rubber? What? He didn't Wait, go to the rubber. What have you never no, used up your eyes before? Okay, no. I, he's up top. I, I, I just saw the end of it. I just saw Just that real part. quick, you think Russell Wilson is yeah. not going to throw from Absolutely the, not. That's why I was so stunned. Okay. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Kirk Cousins threw one out, and he was not on that mound. But it was a good throw. Well, that's Kirk Cousins. He's a killer. They probably told him you can't go. He probably said you can't go up to the rubber. didn't have a glove on. What? Yeah, well, that's Kirk Cousins' baseball as well. Mm -hmm. Kirk said, I'm not throwing Saturday. I'm not throwing on Saturdays. No. Well, you can just kind of go up and throw it. All right, I will. What if he floated? Oh, that'd be sweet. What if Ooh. Kirk Cousins Well, it could have been Tuesday, too. It's his off day. We learned that in the quarterback series. Mm -hmm.